There's been a lot of reporting on the news about the targeting of high-end stores by looters, but one target hasn't gotten nearly as much attention. Those are the mom and pop stores just struggling to survive. Stephen Fabian has some upsetting footage of those stores under siege. We've seen the aftermath of the looting spree. Iconic stores with famous names now boarded up. But there is an untold story that is only now coming to light. The targeting of mom and pop stores in neighborhoods across the USA. This was the appalling scene inside a pharmacy in the Bronx. Looters swarm in and help themselves. This pharmacy was also hit. Narcotics. They took narcotics. That's the, that's the big thing. And this was the aftermath at a third neighborhood pharmacy in the Bronx. They're cleaning up now. You can see they've replaced some of the merchandise. But look at where the prescriptions were. Look at those shelves completely bare. The owner of the pharmacy tells me that now he can't fill the prescriptions for the people in this neighborhood who are looking for their medications. $200,000 worth mm -hmm. of medication? Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. Curious. This grandmother gave a piece of her mind to the looters who had laid waste to the deli where she works. This is the neighborhood. We try to build it up and you tan it down. Surveillance video shows the break in. One guy took a swing when he saw the surveillance camera. We spoke to no nonsense 69 year old Lucy Hosley. I was so angry. Liz Clayman of the Clayman Countdown on Fox Business has covered the looting. This is a looter that was inside. They have been taking people out of the Macy's for the last 30 minutes or so. This is our third person we have seen. Those single standing stores, the smaller businesses may be so vulnerable to the lack and loss of customers. And then, of course, to the expense that they have to make to fix their damaged stores, some of them may very well not come back. Lucy says she is determined not to give in. I got some fight left in me, and I'm going to fight.